Audi Convertible is a convincing car for the most discerning owner. It fulfills what its extremely elegant design promises. The Audi Convertible gives you a breath of fresh air quickly and easily. Before opening the top, switch on the ignition and put the handbrake on. This is mainly for your safety. Then fold down the handle in the centre of the windscreen frame and turn it to the left. Lift the top a bit and push the front part up into a vertical position. Push the rear part of the top up too. By pressing a button on the side of the door jamb, the lid of the compartment for the top is unlocked electrically. Open the compartment and lower the entire roof into it. That's all. By pressing the comfort switch, you can lower all four windows simultaneously. The frame of the windscreen has been greatly reinforced through the use of new kinds of plastics, which results in the greatest possible stability. The typical Audi bonnet accentuates the appearance of power and elegance. The Audi convertible has a powerful 98 kilowatt, 133 bhp, five-cylinder fuel injection engine. It's an extremely refined drive unit with reassuring reserves of power. In addition, a four- and six-cylinder engine version will be available later, naturally with catalytic converters. The running gear of the Audi convertible is designed to be sporty. Reinforced springs and special gas-filled shock absorbers ensure balanced driving characteristics. The design of the body emphasizes the roadster appearance. The luggage compartment lid can be opened easily and has gas-filled struts. The lid has an extremely wide opening angle and an integral warning triangle. A low loading edge and ski bag complete the equipment. The perfectly shaped rear end rounds off the superior appearance of the Audi convertible. The generous interior has ample space for four people. The sport seats with standard frame type head restraints are molded and height adjustable. They immediately give you the safe feeling of being at one with the vehicle. The appearance and texture of the high grade jacquard satin seat upholstery are equally appealing. Exclusive leather fittings are available on request. The Audi convertible is a genuine four seater. The rear passengers can also enjoy the fresh air in comfort. Rear loudspeakers are available as an optional extra so that all passengers can enjoy the music. The cockpit combines the functional requirements of a sports car with those of occupant safety. All displays and controls are well placed in the driver's field of vision and within easy reach. The centre console has numerous additional sporty instruments. Radio and air conditioner are available as optional extras and are integrated in an optimum way. For the instrument panel, which particularly on convertibles tends to vibrate and have lateral movement, Audi engineers have developed antlers, as they're called. These antlers are an intricately designed reinforcing element between the vehicle tunnel and instrument panel to effectively stabilize the instrument panel. The design of the door neatly incorporates the controls for the electric windows and heated door mirrors. The door sills have been kept extremely low and especially reinforced. Nothing is in the way when getting into the car. The door hinge pillars and striker pins, where the doors hook into the body, also have extra reinforcement, though this doesn't hinder the door being opened in the case of a side impact. The moulded spoiler completes the aerodynamic appearance. The elegant spoke design wheels, available as an optional extra, add to the sporty character of the Audi convertible. Another optional extra, the rear aerial, which can be raised and lowered electrically. When the side windows are up, driving in the open Audi convertible is pure pleasure, even at high speeds. The soft contours of the body with its flowing lines and balanced proportions will not only convince enthusiastic fans of convertibles. There's no annoying overroll bar. All four windows are fully lowerable and the folding top disappears completely into its special compartment. The Audi convertible is a completely open car with a classic roadster look. 
the Audi convertible has the advantage that it can be driven open, but is just as comfortable as a coupe or saloon. Its distinctive, up-to-date design immediately sets it apart from all other convertibles. For all that, the Audi convertible is still a typical Audi, designed by Gerhard Pfeffeler, head of the exterior design department at Audi AG, and therefore responsible for the exterior design of the Audi convertible during the development stage. Why did you develop a convertible based on the coupe? Well, the reason we developed a convertible on the basis of the coupe was that we were looking for a vehicle from which to develop a convertible as economically as possible with minimal compromises. The Audi coupe has two doors, frameless windows in the doors, and a compact basic body. In other words, it was absolutely ideal. Can you define the term roadster appearance? A Roadster is a very sporty convertible designed without a top. It's this sporty character that we wanted to incorporate in our convertible by giving it very dynamic proportions and a fully lowerable top. What's the advantage for you of one-hand operation? One-hand operation makes for easy use without exerting a great deal of strength, so it's also suitable for women. The new bonnet. This design was used for the first time on the V8. Will this line be continued on future models? There was a very good response to the new bonnet on the V8. This encouraged us to do the same on other models. We think that this has considerably enhanced the appearance of the Audi, making it suitable to be considered for future use. Now, a very personal question to the designer. Would you also drive the Audi convertible when it's cold? Naturally, our convertible with its roof lining is fully suitable for use in winter. And what's more, our convertible is also a very lovely car with the top closed. It really is a lovely car. But before a completed Audi convertible leaves the factory and is handed over to its owner, a great deal of work is involved, particularly in the construction of a convertible, above all with regard to manual operations. The standard of quality on the Audi convertible is exemplary, not only in this class of vehicle. What has been pre-assembled during series production is given the finishing touches by hand. Quality control is extremely important at Audi. On the Audi convertible, great value is attached to the quality of all components. Here the top, of course, plays a central role and is therefore subjected to particularly stringent tests. Each individual vehicle is subjected to further thorough testing after it's left the production line. In a hall specifically for convertibles, specially trained mechanics examine each and every vehicle. Here again, Audi maintains its proverbial high production quality, all final adjustments being made by hand. The greatest value is attached to accuracy of fit. Even the smallest screw is adjusted should this be necessary. Everything must fit perfectly. Audi has very high quality standards. Here, they're put into practice. A special feature of the quality check on the Audi convertible is the rain hall. 400 litres, 88 gallons of water per minute rain down on the vehicle. Only a really watertight roof can withstand torrential downpours of this kind.
However, building a perfect convertible involves even more. It's not enough to just cut the roof off an existing saloon. The technical designers of the Audi convertible have come up with quite a few new ideas. In this connection, we asked Werner Wilhelm, one of the technical designers of the Audi convertible, what had to be done here in order to achieve such convincing results. As far as the body shell, in other words, the metal is concerned, nearly everything on the vehicle was altered in order to achieve that degree of stability which makes a convertible as robust and solid as we would envisage a convertible to be. However, this alone doesn't create the high level of comfort. There are additional components such as the latching of the doors and the antlers, for example. What actually are the antlers? We didn't want to have vibration on the controls and glove compartment of our convertible. The solution our development section came up with was the antlers. This is a special kind of reinforcing element which looks something like a stag's antlers and which secures the fittings to the tunnel. Vehicle safety was a central factor during the development of the Audi convertible. What did this result in? As early as the concept phase, we were sure that an open vehicle doesn't necessarily have to have disadvantages as regards vehicle safety when compared with a closed vehicle. Accordingly, the car, in other words the body, has been designed to meet the requirements of frontal, rear, side and last but not least rollover crash tests and we consider that we've achieved our aim. The top is a weak point on many convertibles and in addition the Audi convertible has one hand operation. What have you done in order to make the top as watertight as a fixed roof? One hand operation is a special feature of our top and we've tried to eliminate weak points in other systems. We can therefore say that comfort has been considerably improved for the customer. The watertightness of the top is thus assured and we can therefore say that so much brain power has been put into the details of the ceiling and the design of the lifting system that the aim of making it as watertight as a saloon has, for us, been achieved. Now a personal question to the technical designer. What's special about the Audi convertible for you? As an open vehicle, our convertible is naturally a vehicle with great charm. But even when it's closed, it has a certain fascination for the driver. And that's what's special about this car for me. In addition to the special features, the Audi convertible naturally has everything which is typical of an Audi. All the features which Audi has to offer in the way of active and passive safety. The Audi Procon 10 safety system protects the driver and front passenger when they're wearing seat belts. In the case of frontal impact, the steering wheel is pulled away from the driver's head and therefore out of the danger zone. At the same time, the front seat belts are tensioned and restrain the driver and front passenger, so to speak, together with the vehicle. The anti-lock brake system. During braking, a microprocessor controls the amount of braking force reaching the wheels through constantly increasing, holding and reducing the force, thus preventing wheel lock. Steerability is retained with the best possible braking values even when braking sharply. With its Quattro drive, which will be available later for the Audi convertible in conjunction with the six-cylinder engine, Audi has contributed towards the further development of automotive engineering, a contribution which underlines the innovative strength of the mark. The front and rear wheels are driven constantly and simultaneously. The Audi Quattro principle allows higher cornering speeds and thus offers great safety reserves in critical zones. Its long-term quality is already legendary. Audi is the only large series manufacturer to build its vehicles with metal galvanized on both sides. For example, should the zinc coating be damaged mechanically and the steel below laid bare, there's a local galvanic effect if dampness penetrates this point. In other words, the mechanical damage is sealed. The zinc is sacrificed for the steel. The intricate multi-layer paintwork produces above average service life. The newly designed bonnet is typical of the Audi mark in general and the convertible in particular. The Audi convertible rounds off the model range of the Audi mark. Someone once said, a car without a roof sharpens your senses. It makes you alert, but at the same time, a little confused. Each individual must find out for himself what convertible driving is all about. We should like to invite you to take a test drive.